Hi and welcome students. In this Microsoft Excel 2016 tutorial, I'm going to show you how to center a worksheet horizontally and vertically on the page. Let's get started. So you'll see that I have some content here on my page, and let's say that I want to print it out and I want it to be at the center of the page. Well, you'll see if you go to the File tab, to the Print button, that by default Excel pins everything to the top left of the margin. I'm going to show you in this tutorial how to not only move it to the center horizontally, but also move it to the center vertically. And then by the end of this, it'll be right in the center of our page. Well, first I'm going to click back, and then I'm going to go to the Page Layout tab. On the Page Layout tab, you'll see the Page Setup group, and then there's a button right here for the margins. And this is where you can set the margins for your entire workbook. I'm going to click on that, and then I'll go down here to Custom Margins. After you click Custom Margins, the dialog box for the Page Setup will pop up, and then you'll see your top, right, bottom, and left margins, as well as the space that's dedicated for the header and footer. It'll also show you a preview of how your document looks. These, this little grid here shows you where the um, document is currently pinned to, which is the top left. If I want to center it on the page, there's two check boxes here. Horizontally, which you'll see on the diagram when I click it, that'll move it towards the middle of the page. At any time, I could also preview it to see it has now been centered in the top of the page. So that's how you center it at the top of the page. You have to center it horizontally. A quick way to get back to the preview that I was just at, the Page Setup dialog box, is to click Page Setup right here in the Print menu, and that'll actually bring it back up, and click Margins, and that's where we were before. And now I can click Vertically, and you'll see that that'll move my diagram down, or my preview down, just a little bit, to the center. And if I click OK here, it'll move it to the center. So once again, I went to Page Layout, Margins, Custom Margins, I clicked both of these checkboxes, and then you could click Print Preview to view it on the File tab. And there we go. We see it's now in the middle of the page on both the center, or uh, horizontal and vertical plane. So that's how you center your page horizontally and vertically within uh, Microsoft Excel. So when you get ready to print it, it'll print out right in the middle of the page. I hope this video has been helpful for you. If it has, please give it a thumbs up and consider su subscribing to the channel. If you have any questions, please put it in the comment section below and I'll do my best to get back to you. Thank you for watching and have a good day.